Why does electricity come out of the walls and air comes out of the walls too? So does water. Why does water go into the walls? Who is responsible for bringing all this into buildings? I am interested in finding out more about what building services engineers do. The work of the building services engineer includes making sure water, power, communications and air conditioning are available to everyone in every building and that the environment is comfortable. The oldest and simplest buildings like shacks or huts have few of these things, but today's buildings have many more requirements. Building services engineers design, install, operate and monitor mechanical services such as escalators and lifts, without which the building couldn't be very tall. They make sure the building has adequate energy supply, whether from gas, electricity or renewable sources. They provide heating and ventilation or insulation if necessary. They provide air conditioning and other cooling applications. Modern buildings also need advanced communication technology. It's building services engineers that ensure buildings are wired for communication, including telephone landlines and IT networks. We provide building automation, fire detection and protection, security and alarm systems. And then there are the human needs of the building's occupants. We maintain the quality of the indoor environment. They need light, so our areas of responsibility include natural lighting and artificial lighting, and maybe lighting the building facades. Building services engineers provide plumbing solutions for water supply, hot and cold, and they make sure wastewater can be removed. Building services engineers provide environmentally responsible solutions to all these requirements, developing technology such as passive cooling and green roofs. Basically, it's building services engineers who make modern buildings livable, and our students go on to a variety of jobs. So this course actually really fundamental to teach students about the system design and different building services system. I learned the basic technical skill for being a building services engineer and I know uh, what to be involved in the construction industry. And also I can learn the role of being a project manager and what we should deliver to the clients or the audience when we present our job. The BSc course uh, provides uh, opportunities for the students to understand the services inside the building. They will understand how they would contribute to the health, safety and indoor environment for the building users. It would contribute to the sustainable development by improving the energy efficiencies. Now, I am on the right path to becoming a building services engineer. How about you?